scatters when you play the beat, play the beat. A brainiac effects up. Now press one. Welcome to Page Green's reaction myself, Mark Hector. We're reacting to now Pink Floyd's, Pink Floyd's, Pink Floyd's, Pink Floyd's, Pink Floyd's. Fuck yeah, we are, man. Brain Squeeze back on YouTube, and you fucking know you missed my face. When all the videos went, I panicked a little bit. I was thinking, fuck, I'd made backups of everything. Thank fuck for that. I made backups of everything. But still, seeing the channel be completely muted. It was crazy, but it was just the love and people excited and I was able to get everything back on and I playlisted everything. It was so nice seeing Pink Floyd, Brain Squeeze reaction fans jumping through our fucking Floydonians. I never forget about you. There's a Ren reaction battle that's been taking place. Floydonians, you gotta listen to round three. You'll hear how much yourselves Led Zeppi ELO means to me. Just because I'm not reacting, I saved them for special moments, and now is the time. If you're new to Brain Screech Action Man, this is how it works. Do a play from start to fucking finish. Full of excitement, full of ADHD fuckery. I talk a lot, I'm aware of that. I dance around a lot. Equally, my body is fully aware of that. My 38-year-old core that is in pain after every reaction is fully aware of that. I swear a lot, but the bottom line is I do not give a fuck a lot. This is a hobby for me. I do this just to enjoy life. Life is hard, man. It is so hard, and every so often we need to just zone out. And, and, and you know, music has always been my thing. And to be able to enjoy it with a whole community after a busy day in work of trying to concentrate or a busy day in life trying to do everything that you need to do and duck and weave and survive, to be able to come here at the end of the day and just go, you know what, now I'm going to listen to music my way with people that love me. Uh, fuck it, you can't put a price on that. Well, I can't because I'm demonetized because I enjoy it. That is how much. Comment section is for love. It's not for hate. Hate is going to fuck oneself. I said, comment section is for love. It's not for hate. Whoo! Learning to fly? I'm ready, baby. Oh! Oh! Oh, that gives me like a, like, like a fucking, like a 1970s, 1980s action film, like Stakeout or something like that. Do you know when it like ends and it just pauses and the dude's like that? Huh? <laughs> oh man, I love it. That's what that gave me. Or is it the end credits and they're zooming out? It's always a zoom out and they're walking away. I don't know why they're walking like that, but that's what it feels like. Mm. Into the distance, <laughs> ribbon of black. Stretch to the point of no turning back. Oh, I love his voice. is real Woo! fatal attraction is holding me fast how can I escape this irresistible grasp oh, it just takes my fucking I soul my man eyes from the circling sky I my eyes from the circling sky twisted just an earth oh, the learning to fly He's fucking skyward! Yes! Ice is for me. Oh, no, I'm going back. That's a fucking intro. Oh, the, 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 the structure of this, how it's just been done, and the learning to fly, the symbolic elements of the music, and how it is almost given the impression of flight to a fucking song. Ah, oh, everything about it, and then, and then the guitar coming in makes me feel like that swooping highs and lows. Do you know, like the fucking way in the sky? Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Oh, I love Pink Floyd. Ah, oh, it's like a cheeky treat. It's like a cheeky treat when I'm on a calorie deficit. It's just like, fucking hell, I've got an extra thousand calories, man. I'm gonna smash the Pink Floyd shit out of my fucking deficit. <laughs> that kind of makes sense. That. Oh. 
fall apart Et si je m'en dis bien We can never make it if we're heart to heart That one, ça va là Into the distance Ribbon of black Woo! Stretch to the point of no turning back What, did we go too high in the sky? We're in space. Literally. Woo! Oh. Ah, oh, this is what I love, man, about Pink Floyd. Ah, oh, it's the craziness, but it all makes sense. This is like, um, space! Go! Woo! This is like a Top Gun fucking theme tune! Oh! Absolute fucking gorgeous music, man. It's absolutely beautiful. That is artistic. That is fucking legendary. I it, it just what makes Pink Floyd Pink Floyd by just being these almost test pilots for how the fuck can we squeeze a shit ton of the instruments and sounds together and make it so fucking unique. And I was on a journey, man, learning to fly. I was fucking flying. 
I don't do drugs, but when I'm doing Pink Floyd, f fucking, I was going to say jack me up, but uh, that's awful. But you get what I mean? Positively, musically, jack me up. Is that the right term? I'm starting to think jack me up might mean something else, but you know what I mean. Oh, fuck, you know, Pink Floyd. I just love them. I just fucking love them, man. They are a treat. They are an absolute treat. When I got to listen to the entire Dyke's Dark Side of the Moon from start to finish, I got it. I got it. I understood why when I was taking out individual elements of it. Some people are like, you know, you got to do the whole thing. But don't get me wrong, taking the individuals out was amazing. But then to play it all the way through, it's kind of like that. Where it's like, yes, man, I get it. It's a fucking story. No, fuck that. It's a journey, man. Of music discovery, it is a journey. Ah, oh, beautiful, 